love gay. Uh-huh. I am gay. I'm a gay. I I, I oh. love gay. Okay, it, gay pride, whatever. I just think that. Did you see Mariah? No. So not really gay. Pride. Not that. Gay. Okay. I'm not that gay. Um, I think that. Um, I think we're taking it a little. To, we're pushing it to the limit. Mm-hmm. We're pushing things to the limit. Things are getting pushed to the limit. I watched this David Attenborough um, documentary on Netflix about how, you know, this guy is 93 years old, the nature documentary guy. He's done millions of documentaries on nature. He knows exactly how the world is di- dying. We're, pu- we're pushing earth to the limit. Gay people are pushing sexuality and gayness to the limit. Yeah. The breeding, the, um, the lingo, the imagery, the imagery, dump, the anonymous load, dump, the, the, um, the load the, collecting load. Coll- it, this is, um, you're not, you don't have a, butt. it's a sperm bank. Yeah. Well, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just, I'm concerned. I was just a concerned citizen without judgment. I'm wondering how many loads does it take? Yeah. To find. Yeah. And <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And, and the way, the way, yeah. The way we make pride merch too, doesn't always have to call back to the bedroom. I think sometimes like mm. a baby onesie that says top bottom and then like undecided, <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if, I don't know if as, Queer people, we need to be immediately identified by the sex we have, yeah. which is why it's so shocking when people ask things like, who's the top or who's the bottom in a relationship or who's the man or the woman? It's like, yeah. when you random straight person, when you see me as a gay person, your mind immediately thinks about what kind of sex do I have? Right. That is weird. It is weird. And I think I've, and I know from a, 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 like personal observation in, you know, locker room chit chatted, gay people are so wild. They're wilding out with Nick Cannon. They really are. Every day. It's the secret life of pets. It's the secret <laughs> life of pets too. Well, snippies. 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 It's girl. It's, 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 it's wild. It's wilding out with Nick Cannon. It is. It really is. But you know, I think snippies is sort of the frontier. It's, it's a reversion. It's encouraging knowing less about other, the partner. It's encouraging Maybe not knowing what they look like. Yeah. Maybe in public. Which also I feel like is a it, the the upside. It's a great boon for the ugly. Do you like public sex? Are you turned on by public sex? Um, uh, uh, no, I don't think so. Okay, but uh, so if you were somewhere, let's say you were on a beach. I don't beach. want to get arrested. Well, let's say you're on a beach. Okay. And someone really hot is coming on to you, mm-hmm. and you guys are starting to get handsy. Would you be? Would you A, go along with it because it's in the moment or B, be like, oh, this is better because there's excitement? Is it uh, the excitement? Like, does it turn you on that someone might see you, I don't know, sucking dick in a park bench? I don't know. Uh, no, because I, I think it, I have the th- the the fear of legal action. Me I don't too. want to be labeled a sex offender. Me too. But if we, perhaps if we lived in a world where the naked body wasn't criminalized, yes, things might be a little bit different. And yes. I wouldn't even have this conversation in my head. We wouldn't be talking about load collecting. Have, <laughs> have you ever had sex at a gym? Uh, no, no. I did once. Bathhouse. Uh, oh, okay. Bathhouse. Okay. Yeah. But that was like in Brazil. Yeah. Where people were, I mean, it was a place to have sex. Right. You know what I mean? Have a sex. Have a sex in the gym. I was at a gym once. And this guy came up to me and it was one of those gyms that was like day pass, you had $22 day pass for the gym, which I was like, God, it's close to, it's close, to whatever. Great. $22 for a day pass, I think is a lot. Yeah. I well, think it's a lot. Well, yeah. Granted, I know as a member, I'm not a member, I'm getting allowed in. I'm very thankful. Great. I'm at the gym and this gentleman comes up to me and starts talking to me. I'm like, uh-huh. Yeah, great. Oh, wow. It's like, oh yeah, this gym, whatever. And then, um, so I'm in this city and they were like, yeah, this gym is actually famously owned by like a conservative, uh a conservative public figure, this, oh. this, this gym. And it randomly is like the cruising place. Wow. And the guy's telling me this and I'm like, anyway, that's cool. And I'm so thick in the skull. I don't two think two I'm together. getting cruised. Like, I don't think right. I've never, I've never, you have to pay attention to get cruised and I'm never paying attention. No. So like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yes, so like, they do. You have to be like, did someone look at me? Yeah. Yeah. They'd have to have two fingers up your ass for you even like to you be conscious of them. Like, interested. exactly. Yeah. I have my headphones and I'm listening to music. I'm like, do you remember? <laughs> You know, like I have my own stuff going on. And then I'm like, it didn't occur to me that he's might be hitting on me by making me aware of the fact that this is technically a hookup gym. And I didn't know it was a pretty empty gym, but it was the middle of the day during the week. So I figured they're all empty. I go to the locker room. The locker room's like almost like a lot of winding 
Every day is a, a winding, winding road. Very, so show crow. Yeah. And I'm changing. And the guy who talked to me earlier comes by and he's in a towel. And the towel swings open and he goes, are you coming? And I go, get out. What is this? Like you're on oh Debbie Does my. Dallas. Yes. Debbie and does I was Dallas. there to work out. So I didn't know this was going to happen. Oh so I felt stars. almost like I would have felt pervy if I came here like. Right. Because I, I don't want to have sex in public. It's just, if you're going to have a hookup, do it in a room private. Me personally, I would rather do private. Yeah. And this guy's like, are you coming? And I'm like. I was on the way to the shower, so I guess technically I'm going to that area of the bathroom with you. Yes. Open concept shower? No, individuals. Individuals, individuals. with frosted glass. Frosted glass? So then I'm like, well, I guess we're doing this. So and then we off, but. Oh. That's pretty mild, right? Yeah. But I wasn't looking for it. It happened upon me. That's, yeah. I mean, sex, it, it often does. Yeah.